Hi Blender fans, this is JNM and today I will show you how to implement an add-on with Python with that you can draw into the 3D viewport. I added this to my fast carve add-on. When I press Ctrl, Shift and F, my immediate mode, a modal operator, is activated. And then I can press the M key to switch between the modes difference, union and slice. Okay, now I activated the difference mode. Then I move this cutter object over here and each time I press the spacebar it is cut into the target object. When I press escape the operator is closed and the text isn't painted anymore. Okay, so let's have a look at the Python code and start with the init file. In the register function I get the key config for my add-on and add a new key map item for the immediate mode operator that will be invoked when F, Control and Shift is pressed. This operator I added to a separate file and here I import the modules BLF that contains utilities and function for fonts and the BGL module that is a wrapper for OpenGL. When the operator is invoked I register a draw handler, a function called draw callback px and the member variable self.mode is initialized to zero. I register the operator as modal handler. This means the operator stays active or in this modal mode as long as the modal method doesn't return that it should be finished. And I will finish it when the escape key is pressed. And when the user presses the M key, I increase the value of the mode variable but I use the modular operator to cycle it, ok? So when the value is 3 I start again by 0. So the values can be 0 which means difference, 1 is union and 2 is slice. I keep the operator running and when space is pressed I execute the boolean operation that corresponds to the current mode. Ok, when the operator is finished, the draw handler will be removed. So let's have a look at this draw handler. In this method I draw the text of the current mode to the 3D viewport. First I define the X and Y position where I want to draw my text. So I get the width of the region and divide it by 2 to get the horizontal center of the viewport. The Y position I set to a constant value of 50. Then I define the text for the current mode. If it is 0, the text is difference. If it is 1, the text is union and otherwise I set it to slice. Then I use the format method to add the mode text to this string here between the brackets. A very useful Python function and then with the BLF module I define a font with a size of 30. Then I calculate the dimensions of my text so that I can center it horizontally. Ok, the last thing that I have to do is to define a color, I set it to white and then I draw the text into the viewport. Alright, so let's run the add-on and then activate the operator by pressing Ctrl, Shift and F. We already saw the difference boolean mode, now let's have a look at the union operation. So pretty cool, but I want to draw a semi-transparent rectangle as background for the text. For transparency you have to enable GL Blend. Then I define a color and the last parameter is the transparency, the alpha, and I set it to 30%.
Then I use the OpenGL method GL rect I to draw the filled rectangle. And here's the result, the red semi-transparent rectangle and the white text displaying the current mode. So if you're interested in the BLF and BGL modules, you can have a look at the Blender documentation. I added the links to the description below. So guys, that's it. There are not many videos out there for coding add-ons like this, so I hope you like it because you can do really amazing stuff with it. If you find my channel interesting, then don't forget to subscribe to be notified when the next tutorial is online. Thanks a lot for watching and I hope you come back soon to JNM.